howdy everybody welcome welcome to a sunday afternoon edition of that's railroad where uh, we bring the railroad to you <laughs> we love doing it too i want to thank you thank you thank you very much for tuning in and watching today got a little situation here we got to take care of it's going to be a temporary fix uh we've got a lot of rain here in the last couple of months and uh situation here where we've got a pretty bad mud hole that's developed rather quickly actually and we got a real low joint right here so uh, i've tripped this swept this out with my tamper i'll show you that in a minute and uh, i don't have a lot of other tools to work with today so this is a temporary situation until we can get up here and get this cribbed out right but uh fortunately we got good ties in here so regulator's going to come up here and clean this side up all this stuff over here shove it out of the way uh, i got a good bit of the mud out of these cribs i think it's not a perfect job but uh, that's what i got with my tamper anyway and then he's going to come up here and we're going to cut this outside shoulder off and i'm going to sweep these ties off too so okay that's where we're at uh can't get the middle with my tamper need a better machine in here but like i said this is a temporary situation it's fixed until we get this tripped out right all righty i got uh yeah yeah a lot of mud so this happened really quick so all right you can see where the track's been pumping up and down obviously We'll get some good rock under this outside, some good rock, and we'll dump the middle, and I'll I'll tamp as much good rock as I can on here to hold this up until we can get her fixed up right. All right. We'll be back with more. We'll get the regulator up here. And uh, I'll sweep this out here. Okay. Cribs out. Trying to get rid of some of this mud. And we're going to fill this up with rock. Uh oh. A little hard to do this one hand. I got this button right here. And I push this one down, and that takes your work head down. And then I push this uh, toggle switch, and that takes it out. And we'll get the regulator up here to clean this up. I had a video on crib sweeping before, up there above bridge four. And we're going to do the high side too. This is a temporary situation. Temporary fix here. We got a really low joint here on the uh, outside. And uh, try to get some decent rock in here to uh, try and hold this track service till we can get up here and get this cribbed out. Hopefully that will happen here. Uh, next spring when we have a big shutdown hopefully it's not the perfect solution that's for sure but I said this is a temporary solution for now it's all I have to work with really right now this is this low joint over here you can see it you probably can't see it very well this uh we've had a lot of rain here here in the last two months and this kind of like this mud hole just kind of like developed over the last two months Well, 
That's railroading, huh? Uh oh. Fortunately, we got good ties in here. That helps. Okay. You can see this is pretty, pretty bad here. that water to drain away. There goes the water. I wish I had a better machine to do this with. But I don't two kissing ties there. All right. All right. Ah. Back up here. Okay, we'll be back with more. That's good, buddy. about that I wasn't paying attention to my phone here I was looking over there at that rail see there we got a little bit of a kink break in there right in front of him it's not too bad yet we gotta align that out gotta do what you gotta do with the equipment you got rock cars down there getting loaded right now Okay, very good. That's just full of coal. See all the coal in the track, there's cardboard sweep. Doing a good job. All righty. Not pretty heavy. But we're going to use the rock up.
Okay. Make another pass on there, and I got to get to work, get this tamped up. Nice. All righty. Okay. I got one pass made through it, and it, my goodness, it's looking ten times better already. It's filling uh, just on this end of the, they're uh, using a good bit of rock up. It was pretty low. But uh, I've got three quarters of an inch of super elevation in this curve. And uh, the first pass, I put uh, half inch of super elevation. I just changed it in my computer to three quarters of an inch. Uh, this is a five degree curve. And the train speed's 25. So he's going to fill that in. I'm going to uh, tamp it again quarters of an inch of super elevation and, uh, and we'll probably have to dump it and uh, tamp it again but my goodness gracious it's looking ten times better already than it was you know I, I lined it the line I took that little kink out that's in there out uh, the alignment on the uh, track looks pretty doggone good right now okay you got me filled in Make a pass forward, and uh, I'll get back to Tampa. Pretty cool stop, huh? This is railroad. Ha ha! Got to do what you got to do. Gotta keep this train safe. All right. It's been really cold here. We haven't had a chance to uh, to do much of this because. Uh, there last weekend and it was like 22 degrees. Can't. Uh, All right, come on back. It looks good. Yeah, it's looking really good right now. Get a bunch more rock under those ties. We'll be in good shape. I'll tamp it again, uh, Bob, and then uh, see if you got to dump it or what. All right, we'll see where we're at. Okay, very good. Nice. All right, we're, uh, this is my plot, and uh, we're right there. Uh, you can see these white lines up and down. That's where that uh, little kink was. I said I got most of that out this first pass. All right. All right, this is my second pass. So I used up a good bit of rock that time. I said pick this uh, high rail up a little bit more and uh, had a little bit of lift over here on this side. So uh, it's looking really good. He's gonna dump it uh, with the train uh, right now. And uh, it's looking great. I'm gonna tamp it one more time and uh, get a lot more, get more rock under there and hold that up. So, okay, very good. Uh, I wanna, I gotta get out of this guy, out of his way here. All right. <laughs> Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's show. And uh, we're very, very thankful for you guys. Have a really good day, and happy rails to you, my friend. Until we meet again. Watching this, this uh, the locomotive went over it, but it never dropped at all, so that's really great. Just a teeny tiny hair on that joint up there. But uh, that's great. It's not moving. Wonderful. Just wonderful. The train operator said uh, he noticed a big difference when he went over it, too. Come on, Tom. Okay.
Yeah, we're gonna dump enough rock here to tamp it one more time and also have stockpile a little bit. So, uh, tamp it again next weekend. We'll let the train run over. Uh-oh. Look, Bo was leaning over a little bit when the first time it went through there, as you can imagine. Nice and solid, it's not moving. The rail's not moving up and down is what I mean. Wonderful. Wonderful! It's a beautiful thing we just did. up on the outside now. All righty, that'll do it. Fuel gate. Okay, that's it.